did you know I gave birth with the mask on? It wasn't fun at all. Um, so when I got to the hospital, they obviously tested me for COVID and uh, alhamdulillah, it came out negative. After that, they immediately put a mask on me. Um, even though it did come out negative, they still required you to put on a mask, which was weird, but you know, just for my safety and, and other people's safety as well. Um, COVID was at peak at that time when I did delivered in the hospital. However, when, um, you know, when the pushing and uh, labor began, everybody like five to 10 people came all at once and they all had mask on. Everybody had mask on. Even my husband had to wear a mask. And you guys, it's not a fun experience because I couldn't breathe. And the labor was already very hard on me. And I could like, I kept taking the mask off and the doctors and nurses was like, put the mask yeah, So the doctor and nurses were like, put the mask back on. And I did, however, um, it wasn't fun. And you know, until I, you know, delivered the baby and they moved me into a postpartum room, they didn't let me take off my mask whatsoever. And you guys, if I can make it through, you guys can make it through. And I would highly recommend that like um whoever's in the hospital with you, uh just make sure that uh you know they have their mask on and they have their vaccines because you don't wanna um infect your baby and you wanna be safe as well because it's so so crucial labor and delivery process is so crucial that you need all the per, uh precautions in the world so it, it was a good thing in the end even though like I had a hard time breathing and I just kept taking it off. They were telling me to push, I couldn't breathe, so they had to put oxygen on me. But hey, um, I, I did it. If I can do it, you guys can do it too. And you know, my delivery, uh, my delivery lasted at least like one, one hour long or so. So you can imagine, but um, it was a pretty fun experience. So let me know if you did deliver with the mask on and how was your experience. And um, you know, if you're about to go uh, into labor and delivery, what are you expecting? Just make sure about one thing, just make sure one thing that prior to going to the hospital, that if your hospital allows any visitors, because at my time, they didn't allow any visitors whatsoever. I could only bring one person and the person had to stay with me. He couldn't go outside. So it was pretty annoying, but you know, that was my hospital rules. So just make sure that you call your hospital up and ask them, do I need to deliver with the mask on? And how many people can you bring in? Because it does get, it does get a lot tense uh, in the moment, but you know, Again, I made it through. You guys can make it through too. And let me know in comment below if you have any questions.